All right, so we have a throttle cable that's too long. You cut this much off of it, put a new end on. So this is the easiest method I can come up with. Take a rivet, in this case I'm using, using that one there. Eighth inch, um, quarter inch grip. I'm gonna get the rivet loose here. I'm gonna cut off just enough. Okay. Got our little piece here. Gotta get that slit off. There we go. Now we want this cable. This cable will be this long. So first, take these. Link in the description. Hack it right off. Pull the cable out. And it's probably not the best tool to cut the casing, but that's what we're doing. Gonna run the cable back through. There we are. Gonna take this end, pull the end off. Fish it back on here. <clears throat> Did half of it fall off? I think half of it just fell off there. Yeah, the sleeve just fell off. We're gonna rob one off of this cable. Which absolutely was a mistake. But it's for the video, so. <clears throat> And this one broke too. Okay, so we're gonna use this one with no, no end there. That'll be fine. Uh, okay. <clears throat> we're gonna strip some of this plastic off here. this on so we pretend we care. Isn't that beautiful? Okay. Now, since we hacked the end of this off, we don't know how long the cable actually needs to be. <clears throat> so, we need this to be this long. So, mark that. I'm gonna cut it right there. Right. Right there. Before we slip this on there, we're gonna dip the end in some solder paste. So we're gonna dip that in here. Let's get a little on there. I'm going to slip this end on. A little smush. just to be sure we're not I'm just kidding there you have it all right got the carburetor there we go oh there we go 
That should do just fine. Yeah, I think so. Ta-da! 